and Gerald Bolton, and he's coming up behind me. He, he's already all cleaned up, probably already had a beer. Yeah, hey, well deserved. So tell me about your day out there. How was it? I was uh, good. We ran into some problems at mile 220. Uh, we led till there, and then um, we had an overheat problem. Blew a fuse on the fan. Uh, my son Austin and Chad figured it out. Um, then they had to put some coolant in. We, we ran, <laughs> Ian ran out to uh, them in the middle of San Mateo's Wash, brought some coolant, and uh, it worked out fine. They took it in from there, it made up about 30 minutes. But, but it was, yeah, we lost probably 45 minutes to an hour. But it shows how fast you are and where you should be. Uh, we got a new, uh, a nice motor from T TRP, from Greg, that really helped. And uh, we blew a front left shock early this morning. These, these two guys changed it in like four minutes. And the Honda went by us, uh, size love went by us, and we were able to catch him. And then Jansky passed us on, on the summit. I'm like, damn, he was possessed. He just went by both of us. And then we caught him in the desert and put probably seven or eight minutes on him. And we got a flat right before I gave him the car. Uh, then they got a flat. Uh, so we, we, we struggled a little bit at the end, but once they got the coolant back in and uh, got over the limp mode issues, they, they had a very good run. So I, got a, I haven't even asked Austin how his day was yet. Well, let's ask him right now. Austin, you came through. You, you don't only need to be a, a fast driver down here. You need to be able to know how to work on these cars. Sounds like you, you guys figured it out. So how was your section out there? Dad wants to know. Um, it was rough. Uh, San Felipe, it was beat. Um, we had some overheating issues. We couldn't figure out why it was overheating. And then um, we figured out the fan wasn't turning on. So we tracked that down and saw it was a bad fuse, so he changed the fuse. Um, we, hit, we hit a rock and uh, we got a flat, but that was just, we just hit a rock. And uh, after, after that, after that, the crossover road with Coos is was not that beat up, that I, uh, less than I thought it would be. And um, we got to European, European, beat like always um we just we just got the car to the finish from european and uh yeah pretty tired um but yeah it wasn't wasn't too bad of a day besides the little issues we had in the beginning but you got it in that's the most important part you guys persevered stuck with it and the the heart really came out as you guys got it here congratulations to you guys and uh I'm sure you can't wait to get back at it for the 400 coming up in September. Yeah, uh, I think we're still leading in points, so you know, just consistent finishes, and then the thousand, try and win a thousand, win a championship. Our last year in an NA car. So, anybody else you want to thank for the team? You got some great sponsors on this ride. Uh, yeah, my dad, my mom, our whole pit crew, uh, my co-driver Chad, uh, Flair Strazer, Walker Evans Racing. Uh, Ari Sun Tires, OMF Wheels, uh, Maximum Racing Oils, um, T TPR uh, Designs, uh, Baja Designs, um, and uh, er everybody else that helps us out. PCI Race Radio's League Zero Company, yeah, everybody else. All right, we'll see you guys in September.